someone you thought of so positively, someone you built a future with, somebody who you could not see a future without. And it just finished with this somebody. So many expectations, so many dreams, so many beautiful moments spent together. And it all doesn't make any sense anymore. So what should you do now? After you have finished crying and blaming yourself for everything that happened, do yourself a favor and try to understand the real reason that led to your heartbreak. The real reason that caused you so much of pain and suffering. A painful breakup is a very good opportunity for someone to realize where they went wrong. And I don't mean where they went wrong in the relationship, but where they went wrong in giving someone so much power to make them feel so much of pain and hurt and suffering. This does not mean that you must stop loving. The word love has been misused and exploited so much that it has completely lost its authenticity. It has completely lost its purpose. If there was a love that was so strong within you, so pure within you, then there would be no pain because of it. There would be no dependence because of it. There would be no expectations because of love. There would be no attachment because of love. Love is just love. You either have it or you don't have it. Love can take you to a completely different dimension, a very beautiful dimension in life. The definition of love is very simple according to nature. You either have love or you don't have love within you. If you have love, then you are in love with everything. The moon, the ocean, the stars, the sun, plants, animals, humans, you're in love with everything. And if you say that I love this person and I do not love that or this, then this is not called love. Your common sense comes into play who you should spend time with, who you should not spend time with, who is appropriate in your life, who is not appropriate in your life. But you will have love for the people you don't associate with also. This is a very beautiful feeling and it's not a very difficult state to achieve if you begin to understand yourself and the nature of a human being. Now if you choose to be with a partner and he or she completely understands himself or herself and you completely understand yourself, and you both are entirely complete just within yourselves and still choose to be with each other how beautiful would that be what is happening in the world right now is that a person who doesn't understand himself or herself gets in a relationship with somebody who doesn't understand himself or herself and they both get together and expect one another to understand each other it just won't work out this way this misconception that movies and poetry have created that we both have gaps within us and we need each other to fill them is complete nonsense. Nature did not intend for us to be this way, to have gaps within us to be filled by somebody else. This is just drama that we create. We are complete and enough just by ourselves. All we need to do is understand this and start working on ourselves making ourselves so beautiful and so full of love that the opposite person cannot get enough of us. This way, love for yourself grows and love for the other person also grows. It is much greater and much more beautiful than the love it was before.